so we had uh, some different looks at the S11, specifically the Plus. And there was stuff floating around. It was causing controversy in the tech community. Basically, the giant camera cutout, it had a weird... It had a weird setup for the lenses inside of the enormous rectangle. Uh-huh. And they were kind of all over like the place. Like scattered. Yeah, they were scattered. Random. And 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 people were saying, could they really be this bold? Or is that just an early prototype and is not the intention at all? Yeah. Well, we have a, a new report here from about six hours ago suggesting that it was all just part of the prototype, that it was all just temporary, that that we shouldn't have gotten so carried away. In the tech community. And instead, they were going to figure out how to lay it out in a more pleasing fashion. So now you have the updated version via OnLeaks. Of course, still a render, but showcasing... Uh, would you consider that to be a more pleasing layout, Will? Yes. It's yeah. definitely more symmetrical. Mm -hmm. And uh, everything's aligned. So right right, th things are where you expect them to be. Now, granted, it's all very dark in there. Uh -huh. The lenses themselves are mostly black. The the camera cutout itself, the whole rectangle, black also. So who, kn who knows how offensive it would have been in real life, in real use, if they did have to be scattered. You know what, Will? I could have lived with it. I wouldn't have been up in arms. With the... Yeah, with the scatter... Design. With the scatterville. Because, I don't know, there's something uh, utilitarian about it. If for whatever reason they were to tell me, look, we laid it out like this because it allows us to have a larger sensor or allows us to do this or that with the technological components. Lens science. Yeah, if there was some lens science that they could back it up and say, no, you don't understand. We had to move them in this particular way because they were, in, there was in, they were interfering with the performance of the other one or whatever. Then I'm like, all right, I can live. But of course... Ideally, if you can get the more pleasing layout, then then you take it. And that's what we have, of course, uh, rendered, visualized today. So you see three camera modules down the left-hand side and then another two to the right of that. Now, they all have a unique appearance to them, obviously, because they're representative of different camera modules. And so you're likely going to have your wide angle. You're going to have your standard, your zoom, and so forth. Five total. Did we find out yet? Is one of them a macro? Maybe that's a possibility. TOF, that could be in there. We have some beautiful 5K renders to at least analyze now. And yes, it's less messy than the original rumor. Does this make you an S11 Plus buyer now, Will? If it has more lenses, sure. Yeah, if it uh, has like a macro lens, it's got a be down for that. Got an Otis mode on it. Otis lens. Yeah. You take... You take uh, you were you went out in nature, didn't you? Uh, Over the holidays. Yeah. You were inside of nature. Yeah. Which is the best place to be. Mm -hmm. And what'd you do? You hiked around a little. Yep. It was good weather for that. Off leash with Otis. Off leash, ladies yeah. and gentlemen. Willie, do off the leash. <laughs> well, not me, but. <laughs> <laughs> the both of you. There were no leashes in sight. Yeah. The two Un of you were untethered out there. It was it was above freezing, which was nice, and yeah. uh, and you were breathing the fresh air, which I think I mean that's what you got to do, as far as I'm concerned. If you get the opportunity, that's what you got to do. So, this S11, you just said it yourself. That's your next phone, five cameras. You're gonna get the best pictures of Otis possible when you're out there off leash. I hope so. So I don't know. We'll check it out. It looks pretty cool. It still isn't a tremendously large camera cutout as a whole. And it's going to take a while to get used to that. And I kind of wonder, you know where my head starts going, Will? It goes onto the wobble thing. When it's sitting on the table, mm. are we going to have a massive wobble there? What is the depth or the height, I should say? Mm. And then how's that all going to how's that all gonna map out when you lay it down like that? Anyhow, I'll get used to it. It's crazy with these things how you get used to it. 